Rising temperatures, recurrent floods, fluctuations in farming seasons and dwindling agricultural productivity are some of the indicators to show the reality of climate change. The negative effects of climate change is a call for concern. Cameroon should be worried because of climate change, because of the negative impact that climate change has on the population. For example, uh, the, sea, uh, the uh, sea level will rise, and when it rises, you do understand you have uh, flooding. Uh, you do understand that the, the, there's also uh, a dry season, then there is no rain also. Those, that's the contra how it is contradictory. Then on the other hand, also, when there is no rain, you do understand there is lack of food. There is lack of food, and of course, uh, there is a lot of this hamatan you see uh, then of course there is heat you know so we have extreme temperature in the midst of this disturbing phenomenon the congo basin forest second largest forest after the amazon offers hope in combating the effects of climate change and the Congo Basin Forest, first, it's uh, like uh, one quarter of the remaining global uh, forest canopy in the world. And uh, of course, we do understand that uh, the Congo Basin Forest, uh, you know, is, uh, we said it's, uh, it's a carbon stock, you know, because, uh, it, you know, the Congo Basin, uh, Basin Forest harbors carbon about, and that is between 24 to uh, around 39 uh, gigatons of uh, carbon. So you understand that's something very uh, important to the world too, because uh, if uh, there is a lot of deforestation then this uh, 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 carbon will be liberated we call it will be liberated in the air and that's what really causes climate change however the Congo Basin forest today is threatened by anthropogenic activities some of the uh, uh, problem first uh, actually is deforestation uh, because of uh, uh, unsustainable agriculture. We also have uh, unsustainable mining, but on the other hand, also uh, other problems that we have. Uh, Congo Basin Forest is uh, over uh, harvesting, that's for timber and also for fuel wood. So these are some of the issues, uh, of course, for construction. There's also these, uh, the development needs like uh, roads, constructions, uh, but also like, like construction of dams and everything without adequate environmental impact assessments. At the 17th session of the Congo Basin Forest Partnership in Douala, stakeholders recommend people to switch to green power, drive less, use renewable sources of energy, recycle and reuse materials as their own contribution to reducing their carbon footprint.